Our topic today is about the uses of rocks. You should remember that at the end of this video, you will be able to recognize that rocks have been used for many things and that they continue to serve many uses. Well, we identify in our previous lessons that there are three types of rocks and we identify individually based on how they are formed. The first one is igneous rocks wherein these rocks are formed from the melting and cooling of magma or lava. Second, the sedimentary rocks which form from weathering, eroding, and cementing. The last type is metamorphic rocks which are formed through high temperatures and pressure. The formation of these rocks are not stopping. It keeps on going and changing one type from the other type due to various conditions. And if this will happen, the term used for this activity is what we called as the rock cycle. And since rocks are everywhere, people find its uses in their daily lives. In the past, rocks were used to make tools. Example, arrowheads are made from flint rock and they were commonly used to chisel and hammer, used for hard and soft objects. Rocks were used in the past to construct buildings. Example, Egyptian made the pyramids from limestone and the top of the pyramid was made of granite. Another example is Taj Mahal, which was built from marble. Nowadays, rocks are still used to construct buildings, statues, and decorations. Limestone is still used in the construction of buildings. Cement, which is made from rock, is frequently used to construct buildings, highways, sidewalks, and walls. And based on the examples mentioned, rocks have an important role in our daily lives. The truth is, today, we cannot live without rocks. Why? Because before going to school, we need to use toothpaste, an important thing which is made from minerals extracted from rocks. So finally, we finished our discussions. And please don't forget the words you always encounter when you study about rocks. Number one, igneous. Number two, sedimentary. Number three, metamorphic. And that ends our lesson for today. Please don't forget to answer your homework in your workbook pages 92 to 93 and your activity 1 in your student's book page 109. Have a great day and goodbye!